Hi, I'm Ellen Haug and I am running for Ward 2 City Council. I learned a long time ago that I enjoy uh, government. I was on a school board for 12 years. I served on the um, Colorado Association of School Boards while on the uh, school board for three years. And so I think that we need to give back to the community. I uh, moved to Commerce City, so I became involved in the um, Board of Adjustments. And once I did that, then I be started coming to the uh, City Council meetings and said, hey, this is something that I think that I would like to do. So when the position, this term came up, I decided I would throw my hat in the ring. I do believe in the team approach. I have good ideas. I can analyze a problem and I can work with the team to accomplish the ends. One of the three opportunities would be the dog track area. I look at the um, King Supers in the northern area and feel that that was the past council uh, legacy that they have. I think that the present council moving forward and the new elected uh, council members, uh, the dog track will be one of their uh, opportunities and challenges. Engaging the city as the northern area and the core area, historical Commerce City. I worked um, when I was a school board member in Mapleton. We had north of North Mapleton and then we had the farming district and so I always re hear, would hear the north and the south, the north and the south. So I'm used to hearing this and I think that we need to come together to engage our city as one city. It's always going to be a north area and there's always going to be the core area because that's the way a city is built and that's how it happens. Um, so, but I think that is something that we need to look at. The other thing I think is partnerships. We have um, an opportunity with school districts, uh, fire districts, everybody is wanting dollars. And if we can combine services uh, so that we can make our dollars go further, I think that this is an opportunity that we have now in our recession area. I see as one of our challenges um, is to keep our city financial, financially um, secure. I think that um, as we look at our resources, we need to look at our economic development. They have done a great job, but we need to continue to look at that. Also, I look at our services in the north area. We hear that they want a rec center, they hear that they want parks, they want trails. They want those things that are happening and have happened here in the core historical part of Commerce City. So I look at that as um, a real challenge. We need to start uh, looking for land. And um, I look at the fact of the dog track and the reduction of price that they were able to uh, buy, purchase the land. So maybe we really need to be looking for land in the northern area of our city. We always need to be looking in the future. We need to be futuristic. We have some other Blythe areas. We have some areas in the north that are vibrant areas. So we always need to be looking one step ahead. And as a, as a council and as a community and as a leader of the um, council and as of the ward, I believe that that is part of my responsibility to look ahead as well as what we are currently doing. We're all different ages in a community. We're young, we're old, middle-aged, seniors, whatever. And so a quality life is meeting the needs of that person, whatever circumstance they're in, whatever age they are. We have services, we have uh, group meetings, we have a way that we can meet the needs of our citizens. To me, it just means that we're able to meet the person where they are in their circumstances and in their age in life. You know, my favorite aspect of Commerce City is I like where I live. I love where I live. When they were talking about that at the uh, council meeting, I love, love where you live. I thought about that and I do love where I live. 
Um, I was raised in a small community and uh, I really feel that in Commerce City it comes across as being a caring community for the uh, citizens. Um, to me, what, what government would um, hold eight meetings in different parts of the city, different times, different avenues to get input from the dog track? They do care about you. And I think that that's the aspect that I like about Commerce City.